If you do the crime, you have to do the time. Now, usually that means behind bars, but one man is serving his time outdoors where everybody can learn just what he did. And today I was talking with him about the decision. Greg Davenport found out there's a price to pay for breaking the law. His punishment is carrying a sign that says, I am a thief. Well, every minute, every time I see him come past that window, I just look like, man, did he really steal that? <laughs> what did he do to, to do the crime, you know? People driving by could read the sign. And maybe the horn honking was encouragement to obey the law. He told me he got caught taking a 52-inch TV out of Walmart. I stole, I got punished. <laughs> the Youngstown man in his mid-40s pleaded no contest. He could choose 30 days in jail where no one would see him or walking 10 eight-hour days with the sign where everyone would see him. For two TVs, which seemed to be quite pricey, I would think there might be a stiffer penalty. Greg talked plenty with me as I walked along the street with him, but he was extremely shy about going on camera. The main part of the story that he wanted told was that he accepted this punishment so he could still take care of his parents. The story of Greg Davenport includes numerous pickups for petty theft, though, in places like Austintown, Boardman, Canfield, and now Liberty. This crime diversion attempt could be his last attempt to change. Maybe you can get to somebody, uh, maybe you can get to their inner side. Maybe they're a little embarrassed by the fact that they have to hold a sign up. So it might, it might affect some of these individuals, so I'm all for it. Now someone checks every other hour to make sure that Greg is walking the street. Which punishment would you choose? 80 hours carrying that sign or 720 hours in jail? We've got a poll attached to this story at WKBN.com.